What if I told you that you could swim in a pool filled with spent nuclear fuel and probably be fine? Now, before you start packing your swimsuit, let's break down the science, because this is way more interesting than it sounds. Spent nuclear fuel pools look like something out of a sci-fi movie. They're these massive, deep pools of water, and at the bottom, you can see this eerie, beautiful blue glow. That glow is called Serenco radiation. It happens when particles from the radioactive fuel travel through the water faster than light can. Yes, you heard that right faster than the speed of light asterisk and water asterisk. It's like a tiny, harmless sonic boom, but for light. So, could you actually take a dip? The key here is the water. Water is an incredibly effective radiation shield. The spent fuel rods at the bottom of the pool are intensely radioactive. If you were standing next to them with no protection, it would be game over in seconds. But just a few feet of water is enough to absorb almost all of that dangerous radiation. The typical spent fuel pool is about 40 feet deep. The fuel assemblies sit in racks at the very bottom. The top several feet of water are so well shielded that the radiation level at the surface is basically the same as the normal background radiation you experience every day. So, theoretically, you could swim around on the surface without any immediate harm from the radiation. The water itself is super clean, cleaner than your tap water, to keep it from corroding the fuel rods. But there are a couple of big problems. First, the water is kept at a specific temperature to cool the fuel, but diving deep would be a terrible idea. The closer you get to the fuel rods, the radiation levels increase exponentially. Your body would absorb a lethal dose long before you ever touched the bottom. And second, these pools are highly secure industrial sites. You'd be arrested for trespassing long before you got anywhere near the water. So while it's a fun thought experiment, the answer is a hard no. It's fascinating to know that simple water can tame one of the most powerful forces we've harnessed. But let's leave the swimming to the professionals in their controlled environments. Stick to your local swimming pool. It's much safer and way less likely to get you in trouble.